10, 11, 12, 13, Dan's 14, counting 15, the Morrison Jeep trailer. 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. Dan, are you drooling over that road down there? Yeah. Look at that <laughs> smile. Oh, he wants to drive that road. Well, we ain't getting. It's September 18th, 2021, and we're doing the Morrison Jeep Trail today. Woo! It's in the 40s now, but it's going to be in the 80s by the time we get there. The Morrison starts out at the Clark's Fork River, and it heads up about 2,000 feet up to the Beartooth Plateau. This is going to be fun. So we're getting ready to go up the canyon. Kind of windy right now. Here we go. We're heading up the Clark's Fork Canyon to the Morrison Jeep Trail. So Dan, how's your feelings right now? Fine. Are you excited? Yeah. Me too. Elaine and I are actually a little afraid of this road. I watched a video last night and yeah, I didn't like seeing those four-wheelers driving down the road. Warning! Single lane road with no turnout, very steep grade and tight switchback turns next two miles. Please use caution. What the sign isn't saying is that there are 22 switchbacks coming up. Not just a few, 22. And there's actually a few more at the very top. We're starting um, the Morrison. We're all getting ready to do different shots of the video. 
So I'm just going to start taking these guys as of actually starting off. This is going to be a fun day. It's going to be a long day, but we're going to take it slow and just enjoy the scenery. have not even done the first switchback and I am sweating. It's hot out there. It's hard to believe it was cold this morning. I had flannel and a jacket and everything else on. Glad I brought my shorts. Are we going straight? Yep. Here we go. Bucket list check off. So there's the gate for the Morrison Jeep Trail. These rocks don't like throw you off the cliff. We're already up here a ways. You're dead if you go off here just as much as up there. Older corner, corner two. Elton's checking it out to see how he's going to approach it after hitting his pumpkin on that big rock on, bold, on corner one. Maybe. A little farther, maybe six inches. Stop. You need to back up.
that was corner two. We've done two corners. It's a hot day. It's probably only in the 70s right now, but that sun is hot. Dan's gonna avoid that nasty little clip. Oh my gosh, he's turning toward the... Oh good. Thank goodness for a straightaway. I was a little scared when Dan approached that cliff. Ooh. that a rattlesnake is gonna get her. Oh yeah. Yeah, you should be. Look where she's sitting. Like, oh. It's not going fast enough. We need to be on 16. 16's a scary one. Yeah, we need to get it over with. <laughs> We're still under the stress thing. We'll know how bad 16 is when we all forget to push record. Because <laughs> <laughs> we're all so scared. Turn 8 is a rock pile. Morrison Jeep Trail 2021. Woo! Look this, at is, this is a rush. Look a at that view. A couple of times the guys have gotten a little close to the edge that my heart still... But <laughs> other than that, it's been good. Yeah. Somebody's coming up the trail behind us. Oh, we're halfway up and the sun came back out. I can officially say I have hiked the Morrison Jeep Trail. This is what it looks like when you're checking one off the bucket list. Dan! Um, He's gonna break some. Turn 13.
behind us now. So we're gonna have to figure out how to get three vehicles on one road hanging off a clip. you pass on the Morrison. is more than welcome. I think I'm actually going to drive right here, stick my tire right here, my right tire, turn around and I want to go up this chute. Yeah. I don't think I want my tire over here. This is yeah, too narrow like for him like to right. drive on. Without backing up. You know, people lose, it get air here on one tire. They tip. an idea of the tilt the tilt here because I'm just standing right here Dan's there it's quite off camber well the one guy was popping a wheelie coming up that but maybe had he been able to disconnect his sway bar he wouldn't have I don't know it's like standing on a really really tall ladder really tall ladder. Not for the faint of heart.
You got plenty of room behind you. Woo! Oh. I must be on some insect nest. I'm either sunburn or I'm really hot. Or both. And when I lick my lips, it's so salty, it tastes like potato chips. Well, not the potato, just the salt. I Very know. salty. Oh no. Brush it, it off. Looks like I'm peeling my pants. Both pants. They're black, so you're not gonna see it. All right, so who's gonna see ya? Now that's straight down here. I mean, look down there. Just a And you can tell where it gets the hottest. <laughs> Let me see your breath. That's what I'm laughing at. What? Melissa, you are evil. <laughs> it's not sweat. It looks like sweat. I spilled my, right when I was taking a drink, Dan stepped on the gas. <laughs> and it spilled water all the way down. I told him it's hot out here. Yeah. That's the ultimate of sweating. Amen. <laughs> well, we walked the whole thing. We did. goes from there all the way to the uh, highway Chief Joe highway some guy went hiking I guess I don't know what he was doing for sure but they found him dead he'd been eaten by a grizzly bear and that's the trail right there yep we gonna make it I think we have two more was that 20 or 19 I forgot. I've lost count. Well, we're probably totally. I'm lost. hoping it was 20, but we're probably not. It would right. be one more. Yeah. One more. Yeah! Yeah! Maybe two. I don't know, it's pretty steep.
All right, so we've officially passed the last switchback, number 21. Uh, looks like the road's pretty steep here with a lot of big boulders, so we're gonna go ahead and record this too. Looks like it could be fun. and Jeep trail switchbacks are behind us. We still have like, I don't know, 15 miles to get to the highway or more. So we're coming up the last part of the Morrison. We did it. That's another thing off our bucket list. You guys want a rush? You should go up the Morrison. It's 3.15, we eat breakfast at 7, we climbed a mountain, literally. Now I'm too tired to get out and get my lunch out of the cooler, which is only a salad. Who brings a salad on the Morrison G Trail? What was I thinking? Bring some meat. Look how steep, steep that road looks going up that. Mm -hmm. 
That's pretty steep. The Easter egg. Ready? Yep. Every Jeep has an Easter egg. This is an old Willie Jeep. Jeep. Oh, neat. Right on the bumper. That okay, is you cool. You can take that bumper off. Yep. Now is a nice place to have a picnic. Let's go, boys. Can I have just one smile today? Gosh, Dad, smile to me. It's a long way down. That's all I can say. This could be considered like a final switchback. Right. Look how they flipped that rock up. top of the Beartooth Plateau, a couple thousand feet over the Clarks Fork River. We're clear up on top of all the switchbacks and everything else. There's Harp Mountain in the distance. Down at the bottom of those cliffs is the Clark, Clarks Fork River. right-hand corner is where you go from Clark up the Clark's Fork Canyon to the base of the switchback. This route is about five miles. The red route in the bottom right-hand corner is the switchbacks going up the Morrison Jeep Trail. These are the switchbacks most people are referring to when they say the Morrison Jeep Trail. The switchback stretch is about two miles. The final leg of the Morrison Jeep Trail starts at the top of the switchbacks. It climbs on up 4,000 feet to the top of the Beartooth Plateau. After about, well, it's a little over 15 miles, you will reach the Beartooth Highway. A little range where you can take it a little smoother. I don't 
think there was any side road where they could have taken off. Well, they could have went over by that ranch, I guess, huh? Yeah, there was a road there. What's your name? Trish and oh, Clint, Trish Davis. And Clint Davis. From you came to a place where people come from all over the country to ride. Yep. Yeah, we looked it up and we seen the switchbacks and the well, we might as well go try it out. Yeah, now you're gonna get to try it out going down. Yep. Have fun. Yep. <laughs> we ran into the four-wheeler. Again, we were worried about those guys because it's been so long since we passed them. We're right, that purple arrow and the highway is right there. And so it has been a long time we're already. About, we're about halfway from the top of the switchbacks. And it's been a long drive. It really was. You know, that was three hours to go 15 miles down a really bumpy road. Well, we were pretty tired, so. There we are at the end of a long, heck of a long drive. The last 15 miles was pretty bumpy. We're airing up for our ride back home. Just a beautiful sunset, I thought I'd show you. I had to put my hat on because I have bed head from smashing up against the sea from it being so wild of a ride. It was a wild ride. <laughs> yeah, like she slept the whole way. Dan oh. said you slept the whole way. No wonder Dan was going so fast. He was yeah, trying to I wake you up. Sleeping. You couldn't sleep on that no. road if you tried. That is not a sleeping road. <laughs> it is not.